ready to go on this trip? All right, get on board. We're setting off pretty soon. He set forth on a long journey to face an ordeal with her. Nevertheless, their voyage was anything but smooth sailing. They found themselves surrounded by a vast darkness, for they found no answers to the questions in their mind. What healed his troubled soul, nonetheless, were her clear songs. Oto, are you enjoying the flight? Huh? Oh, sure. You want to go to Ogai, right? Why? Are you going on a romantic getaway with your girlfriend? Yes, girlfriend! No, we're not like that. <laughs> You're both blushing. How adorable! I said we're not like that. Anyway, you're one of the top people at the Archaea Think Tank, right? You must be doing really complicated research. Oh yeah, of course. No other institute can compare to us. When antibodies first emerged, our technology saved humanity. Antibodies? Oh, I guess your generation isn't familiar with them, huh? Antibodies are new life forms that suddenly appeared on this planet. The most dangerous and most grisly of the Grim Reaper's pets. Our mother ecosystem, RCL, sent them on us. The Grim Reaper's pets? RCL sent them? The Grim Reaper's just a figure of speech, of course. They came in groups and wiped out many towns and great things. Nowadays, their horrifying raids have been mostly quelled. But a few decades ago, People thought they'd kill us all. That sounds... frightening. But... why would our planet send such scary creatures after us? 700 years ago, humanity stupidly unleashed a catastrophe known as the Grathnode Inferia. As a result, the world was covered in the toxic sea of death below, and the plasma of the blast line above. But, humans failed to learn from the devastation they caused. Soon, the planet viewed humanity as an infection. Oh no! It wasn't easy to defend ourselves from the antibodies. They were completely immune to the poison of the Sea of Death, and they drew their energy from the blast line. But, the Archaea Think Tank researched this new species and eventually engineered a method to defeat them. Wow. I didn't know they did amazing research like that. So, humans are safe now, right? Well, it's not that simple. There's a rumor that Clastania has started using antibodies as bioweapons. Clastania? But I thought you said the antibodies have been quelled. That's why this is such a big problem. If Clastania can control those killers, there'll be a tremendous power gap. Oh, you don't say. So you're saying that the incident that happened at that time Oh, well, I was just going to the cafeteria or something. I'll go with you. But I want to think about something by myself for a while. Doctor! No! Wait, wait, wait! Please, Doctor! I can't tell whether they're cool or 
goofy. <laughs> Saki. Yes? You're finally going back to Ogai. I hope you get to see the children soon. Thank you. Are you worried? No, I'm alright. Because you're here with me. Oh yeah, of course. Corporarchy consists of an industrial district above and a residential district below. It's the only place in the entire tower where humans can safely walk without fear of being captured by Clastania. Although they have yet to recognize Archaea as an independent country. What? So this isn't even an official state? Correct. For instance, on their map, it's labeled as their territory, known as the Perry Executive District. But there is virtually no Clastanian influence over us. I don't really understand everything, but I guess there are still some places where humans are dominant in the tower. <laughs> as long as you know that much, you'll be fine. Okay, let me tell you some things to keep in mind. First, don't step foot outside of town. Second, don't go to the upper part without permission. There are important facilities that the Archaea Think Tank controls up there, so we don't want any trouble. If we get near the Archaea Think Tank, we'll be in trouble. Check. Although, Doctor is always welcome anywhere he pleases. Would you like to come up there with me again? No, thank you. I wouldn't go, even if you asked. All right, Gojo. Why don't we get some coffee? We've got quite a bit to catch up on. Sure, why not? Let's do that. Oh, that's not fair. Then please let Rika go with you two. Well, actually, if possible, we wanted to go to Ogai right away. Oh, yeah. Sorry. I will take you there right now. Rika, I ask that you please take them safely. I dread the thought that there may be Clastanians lurking there. Yeah, you were attacked in Ogai once, right? Please guard them as their escort. If you're with them, I won't be that worried, Rika. Oh, of course, Doctor! If you ask me to do something, I'll always do my best. Then I'll take a look around town. I want to check out the V-Board racetrack, too. How about you, Fennel? Fennel, what are you gonna do? Huh? Oh, yeah, 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 I'll go with Tatsumi. What were you thinking about? I'm sorry. If you've got something to say, just say it. When you want to gaze at the stars, I'll keep you company. Thank you. Okay, let's all meet at the inn when we're done with our own stuff. There's an inn called Ulark. I'll book us some rooms there. Roger, see you guys later. Uh-huh, be careful. All right, we should get going. Uh, right. So, where in Ogai would you two like to go? We'd like to go to a preschool. It's called Ogai Memorial Preschool. Do you remember its exact location? Yes, but I'm not sure how to get there from this town. No worries. I know that school. And of course I know where it is. Shall we go?
it's here. It looks like it's been closed for ages. There's no trace of anyone being here for a long time. No. I'll be waiting outside. If someone comes, holler. Okay. This is where you used to work. Yes, but... It's empty now. Maybe it was abandoned. Then... What happened to the children? I'd assume they went home. They should be safe. Everything has changed. There were children. The principal. We always used to play together. Everyone was always smiling. So warm. Bright. That's what this place was like. But... That's all gone now. Let's go over there, Saki. Huh? Let's look inside that building. Maybe someone's inside. Oto. Come on, let's go. All right. Where are you going? Crustanians! You again? What a persistent idiot. I'm getting tired of you. You caused me a lot of trouble in Cielagate. Three times! I got demoted to Platoon Leader because of you! To regain my dignity, I'll be taking Saki in today. After I beat the shit out of you, of course! <laughs> huh. Looks like she's really serious this time. She might really try to kill me. today. Let's do our best! Uh, yeah! Uh, you... Come at me any time, morons! Do shock! Please feel mine. You say you protect me better! This is a very good
What the hell is wrong with this bitch? She's way too strong this time. Rika! Aoto! Saki! Are you guys okay? Damn! Archean reinforcements! Rika! Please escape with Saki! Say your prayers, but wait! to take any casualties from the soldiers we commandeered without permission. Retreat! Saki, are you okay? I'm sorry. I was here to help, but anyway, let's take her to the Archaea think tank. Saki. Saki! Where am I? Saki, you're awake. Are you all right? Does it hurt anywhere? Saki. Excuse me. Who are you? Huh? Uh, what did you say? Who are you? Oh no! Your memory! Uh, uh, did you forget about me? It's me, Saki! Aoto! Yes! We've been on a long journey together to get here! Uh, journey? Please, Saki! You have to remember! Aoto? Saki! Do you remember me now? Aoto? What did Saki do now? <sighs> Don't scare me like that. I'm sorry. I... Don't worry. I'm just glad you remember me. to meet you. I'm Raphael, the chairman of the Archaea Think Tank. I'd like to thank you for protecting Saki. How do you know her? It seems we need to have a confidential discussion with you, but not here. Could you please come to my office? Sure. Rika, please take care of Saki while I'm gone. I accept your request. Please walk this way. Let's cut right to the chase. Saki is a Ravatane that belongs to the Archaea Think Tank. What? When I confirmed her hymn code, I was very surprised. Saki herself probably doesn't remember, but she used to live at the think tank. 
But ten years ago, she was involved in an incident. She's been missing since then. Actually, when I first met her, she told me she had been with a man called Kiraha. What did you say? Kiraha was our staff member here. What about him? He died right in front of me. He was killed by the Kostanian army. Oh, goddess. It's very sad. He was my best friend, and one of our most valuable workers. He was a genius. He probably protected Saki at the cost of his own life. May the goddess's blessing bring him eternal peace. If you knew Kiraha, then do you know his son? Just before he passed away, he told me to give this to him. This necklace... Oh, uh, I know his son very well. I'll give it to him, personally. I want to tell him directly about what a great man his father was. Hmm. Is this necklace special somehow? Uh, what do you mean? Well, I actually have the exact same necklace. See? Could you let me have this necklace? Huh? This certainly is the same as Kiraha's. I'd like to examine them both more closely. I'm sorry, but this is a keepsake from my deceased father. I can't give it to anybody. I see. That's unfortunate, but it can't be helped. Let's get back to the initial topic at hand, Saki. Sure, okay. If you two were together for so long, you may have noticed her faults as a Ravatale. Faults? Haven't you noticed anything odd? Like every time she performs song magic, she becomes heavily exhausted. She is contaminated with a serious disease. She isn't even supposed to go outside. Are you serious? When I saw the results of her exam, I could tell she used song magic. Because of her numerous battles, her body is severely fatigued. She needs immediate rest. No! She's sick? Aoto, would you please leave Saki here in order for her to live a long, peaceful life? Leave her here? Yes. It's the only way she can live a long and full life. I understand. If it'll make her live long and happy. Thank you for understanding. You can leave all of Saki's troubles to me, and get back to your everyday life. My everyday life, huh? I know this is what's best for Saki. Her disease can only be managed here. Alright, why don't I head to the inn? Doc said it was Eular, wasn't it?
taught? Alto, are you done? Yeah, pretty much. I see. But where's Saki? I left her in Ogai. What? I found out she was a Ravitail that belonged to the Archaea think tank. Oh, really? Uh-huh. The chairman of the think tank told me it was best to leave her there for him to take care of. You don't look very happy. You miss her? No, of course you do. She was a good girl. I didn't know she was sick, and her illness was jeopardizing her life. Oh, is that right? But he told me if she stays at the think tank, she'll live a lot longer. And that it was her home in the first place. It really is the best solution for her. I see. Sounds about right. I think you made the right decision. Yeah. Um, excuse me? Huh? Are you Tatsumi's friend? Oh, sorry, Sasha. I didn't introduce you. This is Alto. I've known him since I went to Blue Canyon Hamlet. Nice to meet you. I'm Sasha. Welcome to my synthesis shop. Ya ya ya. Oh, nice to meet you too, Sasha. She's my oldest friend. She may look young, but she's a savvy engineer who can make anything. Trust me. Oh yeah. She does the maintenance on my V-board. Sasha's tune-ups are the best in the business. Thank you, sir. Oh, by the way, I launched another satellite the other day. Please try it out. This time, the actual use ratio was probably about at least 30%. Still only about 30. Sorry, sir. Oh, no, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. I'm the one who's making you hurry. No, sir. I'll do my best to achieve 100% as soon as possible. J and K is helping me a lot, too. I wouldn't trust those two too much, though. Hey, what are you guys talking about? Satellites and J and K? The satellite is like an experiment we're working on together. And J and K is a team that'll do anything you pay them for. Archaea hires them a lot as mercenaries. They also help me a lot. I'm sure they're up to something fishy. You can be a bit naive sometimes, and that makes me nervous. Oh, wow. I'm surprised you're so worried about someone. Finnell's gonna be jealous. Huh? Why would she be jealous? Speaking of which, where's Finnell? She was with you, right? She tagged along with me for a while. Then she got bored and went to look around by herself. Did she get jealous? Hmm, <sighs> this brings back memories. I used to come here all the time when you were still working here. I haven't been back here since I left the think tank. Sell this place. It's getting weathered, and no one's taking care of the building, right? I'm attached to this place. It holds a lot of precious memories of my sister. That's what I thought you'd say. Have you found your dad yet? Nah. Although I don't know if I'd still call the man who's abandoned his son and disappeared for ten years a father. It seems like I'm not the only one who hasn't changed. As you probably know, hatred isn't something that goes away so easily. I can't forgive him for leaving me alone. But you continued his research at the think tank. Hating your family isn't easy. Blood is thicker than water. 
Gojo, you can say that because you probably had a loving family. I don't have any family anymore. Oh, I see. I guess we have something else in common. So it seems. Okay, why don't we go now? What are you going to do from now on? If you don't mind, why don't you come with us? No, we have to part here. Based on what you've given me, there's something I need to investigate further. I see. Thanks for the information. If something happens, contact me. <sighs> this is the first time I've been here in a while, but it hasn't changed a bit. It really is the same as it was back then. Aisha. Huh? What's this medical chart? That's... Oh, I guess I left it here. No wonder I couldn't find it anywhere in the new office. Oh yeah. I made this chart the day I vowed to uncover the truth about Arkea's conspiracy. I will avenge you, Aisha. I'm done with the maintenance on my V-Board. If you're going to the end, I'll go with you. All right, let's go.